Hey, how's everybody doing out there? My name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Crystal Age Technology Screen, choosing Smart Technology Gain. Today, I'm going to paint in a projection screen using our, um, let me find a screen paint over here. I'm going to be using our Eclipse TI-47 Slate 4K Gold. So that's what I'm going to be using today. This is a screen paint right here, and I'm going to be painting it on the, uh, this is the test wall. All right, so um, over here we're going to be using uh, my ViewSonic long throw projector uh, at 800 by 600 res, around uh, 3200 lumens. We are about a good maybe 12 feet from the screen. All right, so very easy to do. I'm going to show you how to paint a screen in. Very easy to do. A lot of people out there would make it sound like you have to go through all this insane. Um, I don't know, preparing as in priming the wall or you know, all kinds of stuff to say like you got to use a particular roller, it has to be this particular um, kind of roller, it doesn't make a difference. Just grab a roller and just paint your screen. Pretty much that's basic about it. I just, this is one of the rollers I picked up. Um, it doesn't make a difference as long as it's not a foam roller. You don't want to go with a foam roller because the foam roller will leave streaks all in your screen. So this is what you want to go with right here. This is basically will do the job right here, an everyday nap roller. And you know, a lot of people out there would try to make it sound so complicated in painting the screen. It really isn't that hard, especially when using our technology. And then over top of the screen, we have our 300 watt floodlight. Uh, yeah, plenty of light, and the walls are painted nice and white over here to um, illuminate more light. Okay, so let's begin. Let's uh, open up our paint. We'll pour a little bit right here on the cardboard. Right there, like so. Grab my roller. And it's all the way. And we'll dab it on the roller right here. There we go. And we'll begin. This is pretty much very easy. It is a uh, one paint, I mean, sorry, one coat application. That's it. about it. Let me get some more paint here. There we go. And I got some more behind me. There we go. There we go. Put that in there real good. We'll just roll it right on. Mind you, I'm doing this with one hand. So I'm just going to paint right around the edges. And I'm using frog tape. I particularly like to use frog tape because frog tape causes a suction around the screen, sorry, around the tape. And it's not a suction, but it kind of causes a vacuum around the tape. And that keeps the tape from, uh, from um, uh, the paint from pushing through. That's basically about it right there. Okay, let's get some more on the roller. Right. So I get around the corner, it's really good. I got my larger bucket here on it for a minute. I mean, a lot more than that. Let me go over here and grab my, my larger roller, a larger, uh, got some around here somewhere. Gotta get some more paint in there and make some more. Alright. Let's see. There we go. There's my other container right there. Alright, there we go. Make sure I got more. I didn't put enough in there when I made it. That's basically about it. It's the one coat application. I'm just doing it on a drywall. Yep. There we go. It's me in the big bucket right there. Okay. Doesn't make a difference if you go side to side 
or up and down or right and left, it doesn't really make a difference at all. You got some people that'll tell you that you have to paint it a certain way or it has to be done a certain way you know, or it just won't work or you'll streak the screen up, you know, all that kind of bull crap. But with this, you don't have to worry about it. So you're going around the corners. Mind you, I'm doing this one-handed while holding the camera. And you'll have some people say, well, why don't you get a tripod? Nah, I don't need it. It's that easy to paint. I can do this screen with one hand. Let me come over here real quick. There we go, got the edges right there. Now it says a one coat application. Alright, so I'll start along the top of here. All the edges. There you go, just repeat the same process here. It'd be easier to do if I wasn't doing it with one hand, but like I said, it's very easy to do. I'm painting this screen one-handed. One All right. It doesn't make a difference if I take the ruler and I do it this way, whatever way I choose. Sorry about that if I'm missing that with the camera. I'm just going on an angle right here. I'm just painting this in. That's how easy it is to do. Go over here and grab some more. Here we go. Here we go. The roller just came loose for a minute. I'm not going to take my roll up here for a minute. Gotta set my camera down for a minute. Hold on. I'm sorry about that, people. My roller came loose. Gotta tighten it up real good. All right, there we go. Bring that camera back up. All right, sorry about that. So basically, right around here in the edge, it became loose and uh, had it. Put the camera down just for a second, just to go in and just tighten that up a bit. So that's pretty much basically about it. going back up and down and that's all and this is the TI 47 let's go over here make sure I got all the spots covered up real good and let's go up and down that's it so that's it painted the screen in no time at all it's done that's it done all right it's all done right there Take our tape, so we can get it to peel off from here to here. All right, hold on for a minute. Here we go. I'm just gonna get it here. All right. Paint peel off. Hold on for a minute. I missed the spot. Make sure I get every spot on here. There we go. There we go. Kind of missed the spot, but makes some difference. I'll trim it off nice and well. Okay, there we go. So everything's all done. No time at all. Like I said, fast job. This is a fast job. That's it. Screen's already painted. We'll get moved out of the way. Put this over here to the side. There's my screen that's done. Took me about a couple minutes to paint that. Let me remove this all together off the wall. We are done. All right, so I'm gonna come over here and take my projector off blank mode. There's the screen right there. All right, and let's start the demonstration. My screen is still wet. And this is how fast it took me to paint this screen in, like in no time at all.
screen is still wet. Mind you, I did this with one hand while holding the camera. That's how easy it is to paint our screens in. One hand. And I'm using a projector that's only 700, no, six, I'm sorry, 600 by 800 res. It is uh, 720p. It's never been calibrated, no 4K upscaling, nothing. Still set in the factory default settings. That's my picture quality right there. And we're under a 300 watt floodlight. Okay, before my time runs out here, I'm Kenneth Burr from Crystal Edge Technology Screens using Smart Technology Game. Just showed you how fast it is for me to paint a screen in my I didn't even go all professional with it. I just painted it every which way. And look at this. This is the Eclipse TI-47 Slate 4K Gold. the angle gain on that screen why it's still wet more than impressive look at this lights out this is how advanced the technology is on an 800, 600 by 800 res projector, 720p. Probably thinking to yourself, mind you, I painted this screen in with one arm while holding the camera. That shows you how advanced our technology is. Like I said, lights on, Screen's incredible. Lights off, it'll blow your socks off. Thank you all for watching.